Hey guys, welcome to Testing Universe. In this video, we are going to resolve an error which is coming while executing our Selenium automation script. Okay, that is SLF4J error. So this is the error, uh, whatever we are seeing here, this is the error we will uh, encounter in the console, right? Or which will be, you know, coming in the console. Fail to load class org.slf4j.impl.static-logger binder. Okay, so this is the error we'll get when we uh, try to run our uh, Selenium automation scripts and let's see how exactly we have to resolve this. Okay, so this is a very very uh, simple example but the thing is resolving the logging errors is very very important because logging is one of the important uh, uh, concept which we have to have or logs should always be there for our debugging purpose for any automation script. So what is this SLF4J? So let's uh, you know try to understand that uh, first, right? SLF4J is a logger used used for logging in most of the Java frameworks or libraries. WebDriver Manager, right? Uh, uh, we are going to use WebDriver Manager in our script. It also uses SLF4J as a child dependency for logging. So this is the uh, you know error we are going to get, right? Static logger binder. And default to no operation logger implementation so for more details so this this entire message uh, will pop up first let us see how exactly that message and where exactly it comes right so this is the simple script uh, I have written I am using web driver manager to set up my chrome driver and then I am invoking chrome driver and I am opening up gmail.com okay so let me run this I'll just open the log file okay the console so let me run this you can see here as soon as i run the first error right uh, of course the page will load and uh, the execution will continue but the first error whatever we are getting is this slf 4j error so which means there is there is some problem in the uh, logger binder and then uh, the web driver manager or the entire script execution which is related to this SLF4J logs are not collected okay so it is very very important to resolve this how exactly we can resolve this so we will go to so this is the official website of SLF4J if you want to have more information about this right you can uh, uh, read through this and I will uh, you know copy this particular uh, website URL in the description you can always uh, refer that so go to uh, maven repository and then search for slf4j okay go to maven repository and then search for slf4j right to resolve that you need if you have slf4j simple binding it is more than sufficient so you can for your implementation whatever binding you want you can use that to resolve the specific issues so for this issue if i use simple binding it is more than sufficient so they have uh, many releases like alpha and beta don't go for that just go for the latest uh, you know stable version and add this as a dependency in our project okay i will copy that and then i will just clear this uh, logging and everything for now so that uh, for our next execution it is clear so here i have selenium dependency as well as web driver managed dependency and then now i am going to add the slf4j dependency so the workspace is building once it, it completes the build you can go and execute your scripts okay the execution or build execution is complete let me execute the script again if i run this now you can see here that error is gone you don't find that error now okay so this is how you can resolve that issue it is a very very uh, simple issue but uh, you should always you know get it resolved to have more debug on uh, if you find some errors on web driver manager or some executions it is always better to resolve them okay so that's how uh, you know you can resolve it so if you have liked this video you can follow us on all these different platforms we have a youtube channel we have a facebook page we have our own website and you can also you know subscribe to our facebook group and follow us 
you know for more interesting videos on testing as well as any other you know technology related uh, information we'll be updating in our platforms thank you so much for watching this video